if I had to uh, appoint a tea shop um, in Harrogate, this would probably be the one for me. This is uh, Lily's, which is on uh, Commercial Street, which is basically the north end of Beulah Street in the town centre, but that's not um, <clears throat> pedestrianised. Uh, there are good things and there are bad things about uh, this, um, obviously. Uh, the good thing is um, that I think it is the best value for money um, uh, tea shop around. And I'll tell you why. You can get a four uh, cup um, pot of uh, leaf tea that speciality, for example, like Earl Grey, uh, for two pounds. Okay, there's no tea bag, it's all leaf. Uh, you get a little strainer, uh, you get milk, um, and the, the, the cups are not, not tiny, they're not tiny teacups, they're reasonable sized. All of that is under two pounds. Um, well, it's two pounds, uh, which I think is, is very good value for money indeed. Uh, I like that you can sit outdoors um, but still uh, be under shade outdoors uh, uh, and I like um, the fact that uh, the staff there are very pleasant but they're not um, intrusive so I mean I share a joke with the guy who uh, is usually there um, etc as I'm ordering uh, and it's brought to the table but then uh, I'm left alone and I'm not constantly bothered by, you know, how how is your experience, is it brilliant, um, or, or any idle sort of conversation. I can get on with reading or get on with administration. The downside uh, to this cafe is that, like many other cafes in Harrogate, it suffers by being one of many uh, along... Uh, the str the same little tiny bit of road. Uh, there's several other coffee shops virtually next door, and I think that does um, probably damage the um, the 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 business somewhat. Um, the food is not as good as uh, other places. I have to admit. Uh, now, granted, I have not. Uh, really tried much in the way of food because when I go to a, a, um, a tea shop the the most I'm likely to have is a toasted tea cake or a scone uh, with my tea that's about all I'm going to have and I have to say that um, on the times that I have uh, infrequently ordered um, those sort of foods from there I haven't been as uh, impressed as uh, with the majority of other places uh, in town, so I wouldn't necessarily say it was a good place in terms of food, but it's excellent for a, a, a tea. Um, I find it absolutely excellent value for money uh, there. The other issue with this tea shop is the opening hours. I would visit it a lot more um, because it would be my favourite uh, uh, by request, but. Um, it's, it's opening hours are basically office hours, so it's not open past five o'clock. Um, and that's quite difficult because I work office hours during the week most of the time. So I only get to use it on my weekend off, uh, sorry, on my uh, weekday off if it's not a bank holiday. Uh, and possibly on a Saturday afternoon. Um, it's not open Sundays. It's not open evenings, and I find that a little bit of a shame, really. It is a, it is a negative point about it. And about half the uh, tea shops in town act like that, and I don't really know why, because I do think that there is plenty of custom up to about 7 o'clock um, on an evening and uh, at weekends. So I don't know, but that is my that is my review, basically, of, of Lily's. Um, it is, at the moment, uh, my favourite, um, and it definitely would be, uh, I would definitely use it more um, if I practically could in terms of uh, opening hours.